Welcome back to the channel guys. So in this video, we're gonna show you the top five handheld diagnostic scan tools for Alfa Romeo vehicles in 2024 and 2025. Now we'll show you the cheapest through to the most expensive and explain the kind of features and functions you can expect from each of these tools. I'm gonna to put links to all of these kits in the description and the pinned comment below so it makes it easier for you to find them. But do be careful because fakes and clones do exist and using those links will ensure that you are taken to the genuine and official product, okay? So at the end of the video, I'll show you which of these tools I would buy if it was personally my money and I was spending money on a diagnostic tool for my Alfa Romeo, okay? Uh, and if you do have any questions, I'll pop the email address in the description below this video. Um, and that way you can sort of contact us and give us your specific requirements and what, what exactly you need from a tool and what you need to do in your vehicle. Uh, please don't put anything in the comments below because those uh, comment sections are completely unmonitored. So um, we wouldn't take a look at that. We will, however, though, look at your emails, okay? Uh, so first of all, we're gonna be looking at this tool here. We're starting with the cheapest. This is the iCarsoft FA version 1.0 tool. And uh, this tool is good for Alfa Romeo if you maybe you've got like a basic warning light on your dashboard so something like a check engine light an ABS light traction control uh, airbag warning light uh, something to do with the transmission like a fault like that this tool will allow you to diagnose the faults in the main systems and reset those uh, systems for you um, the the tool will also do other sort of sub main systems as well like the power steering uh, central locking um, sort of heating and control um, systems as well. So that's the version 1.0. Now this will also do um, service resets as well, okay? So if you need to reset the service warning light on your vehicle, then this tool is good for those systems, okay? Now then we come to the version 2.0 tool. So this is the FR version 2.0. And this tool will do everything that this tool will do. But the advantage of this tool is that it covers a few more vehicles, so it does French and Italian vehicles. So it'll do your Peugeot, your Citroen, your Reynolds. It'll also do your Fiat and your Alphas, things like that. So anything French or Italian. And this also does, it does everything that this does, but it also does a few more service functions as well. So when I talk about the service functions, what do I mean? I mean things like DPF regeneration, electronic parking brake resets, uh, open and close the calibers, electronic throttle calibration, steering angle sensor calibration, new battery registration, injector coding, and ABS brake bleeding. It all really depends on the vehicle for any of these tools, actually. If you're looking to carry out a special or service function and you want to know if it specifically works on your vehicle, then please do use the email address below. Send us the VIN number of the vehicle and we can check that for you. So it does, it, in general, it does those service functions. It doesn't do those service functions on all vehicles. So it is very important that you check with us. Um, but in general, this tool will be more advanced than this tool. So this is the version 2.0 tool. And then we come to the version 3.0 tool. This is the FR version 3.0. This is more advanced than both of these two tools. This, is, this has better software, it has better vehicle coverage, and it has better service functionality, okay? So this will do a lot newer vehicles. Um, and also more service functions. So when we talk about the additional service functions, remember it can do all of the service functions that these tools can do. Uh, but when it comes to the additional, you'll be looking at actuation tests, bi-directional control. So you'll be able to test specific components to make sure they're working. You can activate them to make sure that they will operate as they should. Um, suspension calibration, transmission adaption, air conditioning research, engine adaptions, and other service adaptions. So um, again, use the email address below if you're looking to find out if one of those service functions is suitable for your specific vehicle because we don't want you to buy the tool and find out that it's not gonna be suitable, okay? Um, on these tools, all of these tools, actually, you will get free lifetime updates. Uh, so that's the version 3.0 tool. Now then we move to the iCarsoft CR Pro Kit. So let's say, for example, you have a situation whereby you have your Alfa Romeo and you also have a BMW, a Mercedes, an Audi, a Volvo, something like that. This CR Pro tool is a multi-manufacturer tool. Um, and when it comes to the functionality of the tool and the service functionality, it matches the service functionality 
of the version 2.0 tool. Okay, so it's important to understand that. So although it covers more vehicles, it doesn't do as much as this tool when it comes to service functions, but it will match this tool and this tool for service functions, all right? So that's the CR Pro Kit. Uh, this has been really popular over the years, actually, for a lot of people who don't necessarily want to go deep into diagnosis, who just want to be able to diagnose the faults as and when they come up in their their friend's circle or their family circle or something like that, okay? So that's the CR Pro Kit. And then we move to the tablet-based kit. This is the CR Max kit. Now this does everything that all of these tools will do. So it has really, really good software. It matches the service functionality of the version 3.0 tool. So if you're looking for a tool that basically covers everything, um, goes into deep diagnosis, deep service functionality, um, then this is the top of the line. And this is a little bit more expensive, but you still do get free uh, updates, free lifetime updates, which is really good. And it just connects to a Wi-Fi in your, in your house or your workshop, your office, and you can do free updates just by clicking the update icon. I've um, got like a low battery warning there, but uh, don't worry about that. So that's the CR Max. Now I said at the start of the video, which of these tools would I recommend if it was my personal Alfa Romeo? Um, and honestly, I would probably go, if it was my money, I would go for either the FR version 3.0 if I was only looking for, looking for a tool to work on my Alfa Romeo. I'd go for the FR version 3.0 because it has such a, a good level of software on there and a good level of service functionality as well. If I wanted to look after my Alfa Romeo and my other vehicles in my household, 100% it would be the CR Max because this really, really does pack a punch. It covers so many service functions. It covers so many vehicles, systems. Uh, it does all of the actuation tests and things like that. It's really, really easy to use as a tablet-based kit as well. So um, the CR Max or the FR version 3.0 is definitely where I'd be putting my money in 2024, 2025, if I wanted to diagnose my Alfa Romeo and do resets on that vehicle. Okay, so I hope this video has has helped you just a little bit. Um, remember, I will put the links to all of these kits in the description and the pinned comment below this video because you know the fakes, the clones, they are out there. They can damage your vehicle. It's not worth going down that route. So by using the links below, they will take you to the genuine and official products. Okay, so thanks for watching guys and I hope this helps.